a minister says we will never deal with the IMF and he's dragged unwillingly before the court of public opinion to go negotiate with IMF, we will be negotiating from a serious position of weakness. And this country will not get the best out of that negotiation. And it is in this direction, or it is in the light of this, that I call on the Honorable Kenoforiata as a matter of national duty. And in, and in order to save the little Anna left, that he does the right and, and tender in his resignation. He can still act as an advisor to the government in the negotiations, but not as the minister responsible for finance. We have gotten to a level in our political development that ministers must begin to take responsibility. A minister who categorically states that we will never go to IMF cannot be dragged unwillingly to IMF to lead our negotiations. If we love our country, we need somebody who will believe in what he or she will be doing to lead the negotiations. If Kenoforiata does not resign, I believe the Parliament of Ghana must keep faith with the people of Ghana. And the people of Ghana deserve better than this. Parliament has the power to ask him to go. Parliament has the power and Parliament must act. I am very passionate about this because Keno Furiata must resign to give the president a free hand to choose somebody to lead these delicate negotiations. Thank you.